Swarming, Schooling, Milling Phase Diagram of a Data-Driven Fish School Model Fish schools are able to display some amazing collective patterns in nature. These patterns arise naturally from their interactions and are linked to behaviors such as migration, feeding, predator evasion, etc. In this article, we use a previously developed model to understand the amount of naturally occurring behaviors it was able to display when changing some of its parameters, and especially after proposing a different angular preference in the directions. This model was developed for the species Curemogil and consists in a persistent turning walker with a fixed swimming speed. This means that fish interactions and noise affect the angular velocity of the fish. The interactions are calculated for every pair in the first shell of the Voronoi tessellation and consists in an attraction and alignment term. Experimental data review the forward angular preference which led us to investigate the effects of this new yet simple modulation of interactional form. The first result obtained was given by the polarization of the school for different velocities, where we can see that in both cases we have a transition from a swarming to a schooling state as the speed of the school increases. Doing a parameter scan of the alignment and attraction parameters in non-dimensionalized equations while analyzing the polarization and the absolute values of the normalized angular momentum, we could detect that both choices display a transition from swarming to schooling. We can also see that with the angular preference the schooling behavior has a dependence on the attraction parameter due to the fact that the system now exhibits a milling behavior which was not found without the angular preference. Analyzing the average neighbor distance between fish, we expected these values to diverge when the attraction parameter tends to zero, and to decay when increased. However, the parameter space with the angular preference displayed a second ridge as the attraction parameter was increased. We can define different colors for each of these three behaviors red for schooling, green for high average distance, and blue for milling, to plot his behavioral map. In region 1, we can see the following schooling behavior. Simulations on region 2 show a very good example of a fish mill. We can also see the transition between schooling and milling region, where we can see spontaneous changes between both states. In the high average distance region, we can see that fish organize themselves into files. This is a consequence of the frontal preference and the fact that attraction dominates the interactions while allowing anti-parallel configurations. We have also studied the transition between the schooling and milling state and verified it follows a simple functional form, which is independent of the fish speed. A group size impact study was also done for a fixed attraction parameter and for different alignment values. We can see that there is a minimum number of 60 fish to get a median behavior. And also, that the model is not able to produce arbitrarily large fish vortexes. In conclusion, we have shown that the relative weights of the attraction and alignment interactions play a key role in the emergent collective states that emerge in the school level. Depending on the magnitude of the attraction and alignment of fish to their neighbors, different collective states can be reached by the school.